Hey guys, it's Renee. Welcome to Cute Simple October. So today we're going to be making some snake earrings. The first things we need is a couple of ear posts, and I'm just going to cut that part of them. So I'm just going to be left out with this part. Then I'm going to be using a straw and I'm going to cut this in half. Choose whatever thickness of straw that you have or want. But the thicker the straw, the thicker your snake is going to be. And then I did use some like gauze, a bit of it for some texture. It ended up not showing as much. So just um, if you have, you can use that. But since I'm just using it, I'm just going to tape it on the table. Then I'm going to be using this kind of clay, like porcelain clay. Is a kind of uh, clay that hardens with air. And this is what it looks like. And so I'm just going to be using using this match and I'm just going to roll it into a snake just make sure that the tail is uh, pointy and the head of the snake is kind of like a uh, shabby then I'm going to be working on some details for the face which is like adding two small holes with a toothpick and then on the back of the eyes I'm just going to be putting this part of the earring just to mark the hole and then I'm going to be rolling around each snake uh, around each piece of straw that we cut it until you're happy with how it looks and then we're gonna let it dry to let dry I'm going to be using this block of foam it's pretty old as you can see it's kind of gross I should get a new one but yeah I'm just going to be putting that in there and yeah, I'm just going to let those things dry. One snake is kind of going towards the right side and the other one is like going towards the left side. One for each ear. This clay dries clearer, not see-through all the way, but you can see the difference when it's dry. I'm going to remove them from the straw. Then I'm going to be making these earrings by just gluing them using this. Um, this is pretty random, but this is the only glue that I have so far that has been working for my custom jewelry. So yeah, this is for nails, but I use this for this as well. Adding a drop of glue and just putting that in there. And then I'm going to be putting them to dry again. Now to paint them, I'm going to be using this gold acrylic paint and this brush and I'm just going to be covering first the outside of the snake and giving this a few coats and once it's dry, I'm going to be, you know, painting the rest of this, which is like the inside. And because I wanted them to be a bit shinier, I just added a coat or two of this gloss and yeah, I'm just going to wait for them to dry. And this is pretty much it for this idea. They are so easy to make, to be honest. They look super cute, edgy and just unique. I got inspired from one of the Kardashians Jenner, Kendall Jenner. Just saw this image of her and I love the earrings and I wanted to give them a try. But you know, I did my own twist to them. And this is actually it for this year's Halloween ideas, guys. I just wanted to say thank you for watching. I hope you liked all of them. So yeah, if you like the series, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel for more stuff. I upload twice a week. So yeah, thank you so much for watching. I'll talk to you later and take care. Bye guys.